Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. So today in this video we will try to learn that how we can apply the seismic loading in slide software for the uh, for the analysis of uh, slope stability of earthen dam. So we will try to learn how the earthquake can cause instability uh, in the earthen dam. So let's start the video with a very simple example. As you know, this is the uh, interface of slide software. Before starting any project, we have to uh, we have to define the project setting. So for the project setting, uh, I have already explained all these uh, parameters in my previous video. If you haven't watched any uh, video, you can watch the previous video on the channel. So uh, here we will not be changing any parameter here methods we can select different method and here we can change the number of slices as well and then groundwater conditions if you want to change you can change from here and then transient and so on in the mean uh, at the moment we are performing a very simple example okay now boundaries add external boundaries so I will manually uh, plot a simple geometry. Firstly, I will try to analyze the slope of an earthen dam without earthquake loading. Then uh, I will do the analysis uh, while providing the uh, earthquake loading. So I will draw a random geometry. You can draw the uh, geometry using coordinates as well. So let's say this is a simple uh, geometry of an earthen dam and we have to analyze the stability of this slope. So the next step is to provide the grid okay i have explained the purpose of this grid in my previous videos go to display option and just click show grid points and done now we have to define the material for this slope go to uh, properties and define material here i will be changing the name of material as soil and the rest of the parameters are same. I will not be changing. You can change the color. Let it be this. Okay. Now, the next step is uh, to simply compute the results. and then interpret. Now you can see the factor of safety without seismic loading for this case is 1.377 from Bishop simplified method. You can check the uh, factor of safety from uh, Jambu simplified and so on. Okay, you can draw the slices as well, but now I will quickly move towards the uh, earthquake or dynamic loading. So for that purpose, I will go to analysis and will click modeler. Now I am back to my original geometry. geometry. Now I will apply seismic loading. Now here in loading, I will select seismic loading and here I can provide the horizontal P ground acceleration value. Let's say uh, in the current uh, example, I will I am going to put the value of 0 0.2 g. So simply click OK. Now the earthquake loading has been applied uh, to this uh, geometry, and it is very uh, simple and very easy to analyze the slope stability using the slide software so now we will go to compute 
and then the interpret and you can see the factor of safety has been reduced from 1.377 to 0.926. So this is how we can analyze the uh, slope stability uh, using earthquake uh, loading. So you can uh, obtain uh, multiple or uh, different information uh, from these query option like graph query, show slices and if you want to get the information of these uh, slices, query slice data just click over here and you will obtain the data of this slice. So uh, I hope you will like the video, if you like the video don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you and uh, Allah Hafiz.